default value will be automatically assigned to the integer. Okay. okay. And I'll give you one uh, program. Okay. You are willing to write the program? Yes, ma'am. Yes. Okay. Write down the program for method. Okay. Sorry. Constructor overloading. Okay. Uh, okay, Shavya, your communication is good. Uh, but uh, just uh, your con eye contact is missing and uh, you have a knowledge in uh, core Java as well as uh, you learn more and more in uh, advanced Java as well as SQL and anything. Okay, next time you will be better. Okay, okay. Yes. thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, now we are uh, discussing about the constructor overloading concept. Uh, now let us see one example for constructor overloading. Uh, there are three types in overloading concept like uh, uh, giving methods, giving uh, parameters, and sequence. Uh, we will discuss one program now. Here uh, we have created one class uh, with the name one, and then we, we have created one uh, constructor. Uh, constructor name should be also same uh, one and one. Here we have taken two uh, data types, uh, integer a and string b. Uh, method overloading concept of a uh, sequence. Uh, sequence is nothing but uh, uh, reverse. Uh, here we have taken int and string, and now here we have taken string and int. Uh, this is called as sequence. We have given two values and value 1 is equals to a a. Value 1 a a is assigned to integer of value 1 and the value 2 b b. A string value will be assigned to value 2. Here we have given the output value 1 is equal to value 1 and value 2. And then the next we have taken another constructor name with the 1. Here we have taken string and int. Here we have taken value 1 is equal to dd. Uh, value 1 is equal to uh, int. Integer value will be d. Uh, value will be assigned to the d. 
and value 2 is equal to cc uh, value 2 is nothing but string uh, so when we are passing some values it will be assigned to string value and we have given output value 2 and value 1 and we have uh, creating the main class and we have created the main method and here uh, in constructor we will not call the uh, method uh, we, will not, we will not create an object it will be called automatically uh, by giving some value 10 and shravya here uh, we have given integer value as 10 and the string value as shravya uh, the jv will automatically go to uh, string string where we have given here and the integer value is uh, bb so jv will uh, execute this method 